name is Caroline Ramos and I'm the policy chair for HYPE, which stands for Hispanic Young Professionals and Entrepreneurs. HYPE was founded by Juanita Velez um, in 2016 uh, because she saw an obvious divide in the Latinx slash Hispanic community, um, a lack of opportunity and just wanting to bring us together and empower us. HYPE's mission is to connect and develop and empower Hispanic young professionals and entrepreneurs um, through economic leadership and community volunteer opportunities. The work that we do with Latinos for Democracy is amplifying the message, uh, which is um, trying to make sure that everyone in our community understands what redistricting is, providing um, information, and also we're doing events. My personal experience is growing up, um, there weren't many people that looked like me um, in politics, um, in the news, and whatnot. And as I've grown up, I've been able to connect with more people that look like me. My parents are immigrants, um, so knowing that background and seeing how unfair they've been treated or the lack of resources that they had growing up, I want to make sure that my family and my friend and you know the future generation have more than what I was given and what I have right now. My name is Ruby and I'm the policy co-chair for the Hispanic Young Professionals and Entrepreneurs. So the reason I do this work is because I grew up in a disadvantaged community, not only in regards to the color of my skin, to my ethnicity, but also to the disadvantages that come with the education system. So once I realized that I was at a disadvantage, I wanted to make a change. I wanted to empower others to feel like they're not stuck in the hole that they're in. That's why I do this work, um, because I care about our community. I care about the generation that's gonna come after us, after we're gone and I just want this world to be a better place. <laughs> what we hope to achieve is to educate our community so they have access and can participate um, in this process so that way we all have equal um, opportunities um, and resources. And so we need to continue to have a voice, have a seat at the table to make sure that we're not an afterthought, you know, that uh, politicians don't come knocking on our door two months out from before the elections, they need to invest in our community, in our resources, 